Design lovers from all over the globe are coming to Palm Springs for Modernism Week, and this year promises to be bigger and better than ever. Peter Dout spoke in depth with Executive Director Lisa Vossler Smith to learn about the more than 350 events that will be happening over the next 11 days. Lisa, it's that time of year again. Modernism Week is here. Tell us what we can expect this year. That's right. Thank you, Peter. I'm so glad to be here with you and able to talk about it. Modernism Week is back and bigger and brighter than ever. We're so glad to be returning to our full festival February 16th through the 26th. We're kicking off tomorrow and can't wait. Our, our public headquarters is free and open to the public every day during Modernism Week. That's called Camp, and we'll be inside the Hyatt Palm Springs right on Palm Canyon Drive. You can't miss us. Wonderful. And I know people from all over the world come here for this event. What are some of the big events this year that people can take part in? Well, there are so many tickets still available, so I would encourage everyone to check modernismweek.com. But one of my favorites kicks off on Friday. It's our preview party at the convention center. The Modernism Show, which has been going on for more than 20 years, is one of the premier shows in the country where you can shop for vintage 1950s and 60s furniture, as well as home decor and some contemporary design as well. So that's at the convention center all weekend. And and of course, our premier double-decker bus tours are my favorite. Those are the red double-decker buses you'll see running around Palm Springs. But we offer at least eight tours a day, so you can tour all of the architectural neighborhoods of Palm Springs. I will say I did the double-decker bus tour last year. It was amazing. So anybody who you. can do it should. Thank you. Know, you. I, I ask you this every year, Lisa, but it, it's important for folks to remember, what does Modernism Week mean to our valley and why is it so significant? That's a great question because we've been around for 18 years. So we've been doing this festival in February all that time, but really the work that happens throughout the year with all of our partner organizations is ongoing. Modernism Week really started to help raise awareness about architectural preservation and the wonderful riches that we have throughout the Coachella Valley. All of the architecture that we focus on from that mid-century modern period of the 50s and 60s has been so well protected and preserved here in the Palm Springs area that we have the opportunity to showcase to the world what's special about the architecture and design in Palm Springs. And this year, we're excited that we're looking beyond mid-century modern. Actually, we have contemporary design that's involved, lots of world-class architects and speakers coming to our Annenberg theater lecture series to talk about their projects, as well as some special programming and tours that relate to Spanish revival architecture that was popular even before the mid-century period. So we're looking at architecture back from the 30s and 40s in Palm Springs as well. There really is something for everyone and, and hundreds of tickets still available. And you mentioned it gets bigger every year. This year, you're anticipating it's the biggest year yet? Well, you know, I, I like to think positively. I do think uh, our sales are way ahead of last year, and we know with the world opening again, uh, Palm Springs is an incredible destination for our visitors from all 50 states they visit for Modernism Week and about 20 countries around the world. So we look forward to welcoming all of those visitors back this year. Wonderful. Lisa, as always, we appreciate your time. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you, Peter. It's so nice to be here, and we'll see you at Modernism Week.